So what's coming by right now are gray whale cows and calves. So the gray whale migration northbound is in two phases. The first phase is primarily adults and juveniles. Then there's a second phase that's much closer to the coast that's almost exclusively cows with calves. We think those cows and calves are migrating very close to shore to avoid predation by killer whales. They hide in the noise of the surf so the bad guys can't find them. And the reason we're using these little hexacopters is we can fly them for almost nothing. It costs us nothing to fly the birds. We used to try to do this with manned platforms and it cost us about $60,000 and we really weren't very successful because the animals are hard to photograph. And the question we're asking here with the hexacopter is we're looking at condition of reproductive females. How robust are they? So how wide are they relative to their length? Just like us, uh, when an animal eats a lot, it gets wider. And so we can tell whether these females are well fed and in good condition. And we want to compare that across years. This is our hexacopter, which to us is just a vehicle for carrying a camera. Here's the small mirrorless camera we have mounted on the bottom. And the idea is we want to position this camera overhead of whales and overhead at about 125 feet up so we're not buzzing around the whale but we're up nice and high and that's so that we can fit the whole whale in the frame and have a nice flat frame where we can measure across the whole thing because we're trying to measure length and width of these whales to monitor growth and body condition. I think uh, one of the important things to realize is that um, the paperwork to fly this aircraft and do what we want to do weighs more than the hexacopter does itself and, and that's important. We want to be safe and we want to do things right without disturbing wildlife. So we have permissions from the FAA to fly in this airspace, in this quiet area, um, and we have uh, a permit from National Marine Fisheries Service to fly at the altitudes we do above whales to make sure we don't disturb them.